I don't think I need to remind them. I think they're well aware of what's at stake tomorrow. <laughs> How important this game is for us. And, um, our quest for a conference title, that's been our goal from the start of the season. And it's, uh, it's still attainable. We're going to have to play with it. Play. But uh, everything's still in front of us. Talk about this gladly game. Their team will be by 17 points. What's it like on the way with well, they've been a very good team at home. Uh, they lost by eight to Michigan early in the year. It was obviously Michigan's a pretty good basketball team. Then their other two losses at home have been one possession losses to, to Wichita and Northern Iowa, who are two of the hottest teams in our league right now. So they've been a very good basketball team at home. You know, their two guards, Walt Lemon Jr. and Dyrika Sims Edwards, are as good a guard tandem as there is in our conference. And anytime you have to deal with two guys that are that talented that have the ball in their hands all the time. It, it, it poses a challenge to your defense. And we're going to have to be up to that challenge. Is there something in the last day or so that gives you confidence that maybe the rough lines are behind? Or do you have to just work through that on the court? Well, we've got to work through it on the court, but I, I liked our practice yesterday. It was one of our, our better practices in some time. Uh, both from an energy standpoint and an enthusiasm standpoint. Uh, shots were going in, guys were flying around, and uh, that's, that's what we needed to have happen. That's what we're striving to get back to. Maybe the guys out there are in shot at all, maybe not even taking the shots they just make the game. Uh, I think there's some of that without question, and I think that's human nature. When, you know, when things aren't going as well, you're a little bit more tentative, or you're thinking pass first, and maybe I need to get it into Gregory or Doug instead of thinking about taking the shot. We, we've got to leave that mindset behind. Uh, we've got to have our feet set ready to shoot it. Uh, obviously, we're getting the basketball side still going to be an important part of what we do. Uh, but we've got to let those shots fly. We've got to shoot them in content, confidence and shoot them in rhythm. Has there been any thought to shaking up the lineup at all, or is this you just have to ride through uh, these rough times, as we're calling them? Uh, you know, I, I think every coach thinks about it, but it's just uh, you have to have a good solution before you change what you're doing. And, uh, you know, the, the four of these starters have, have won over 50 games the last two years, so I'm not sure it's the guys that are there. It's just it's the way that we're doing it and the, the way we're executing right now. And that has to get better. And, uh, if you're trying to fix execution problems, I'd rather try to fix it with guys that are experienced. What's these last couple of weeks been like for you as a coach, trying to push the right buttons to try and find out what's happening? Well, I mean, it's, it's your responsibility as a coach to try to, to, try to fix it when it's broke. I mean, uh, you, know, you, you lay awake for a lot of night trying to figure out what, what's the right button to push, what's the best thing to do for this team. Because you, uh, on one hand, you're trying to fix your team. On the other hand, you have some guy, individuals on your team that are a little bit fragile uh, that need to be get back in the right frame of mind as well. So you, you know, you're part psychologist, you're part basketball coach. Uh, uh, so that's that's part of it. So we're we're trying to work through that. Uh, obviously, it's not, it's not fun. Worry just like you worry when you get ready for the next game and win it. It's just a different kind of work. That being said, it's got to be a fun week to be a coach. To be a coach. Absolutely. As I told the guys yesterday, practice is my third year at Creighton. It's the first time we've gone into the last week with an opportunity to play for a conference team. So, you know, we're, we're where we want to be. I don't, I don't like how we necessarily arrived here. But the reality of it is, that, you know, this is, it is what it is. This is where we're at. Uh, we've got to crank it up and 